small craft launch. I'm not sure exactly what it is, but I only see like sailboats and kayaks and these little homemade looking boats launching out of here. So it's pretty nice. Uh, cement goes back all the way down to there for you to unload your stuff. So it's pretty nice. Then uh, I'm gonna take us over here to the boat dock in a minute. Got a guy here about to launch a little mini sailboat, pretty cool. And that's my, uh, that kayak that I had there is a uh, lifetime Teton, like a 10 footer. So it handles okay. Not as good as that, uh, the other one that I have there though, the 12 footer. Um, the Ascend. So uh, I'm gonna come up here to the boat dock and we'll be back in a second. All right, so. I was just right uh, there a minute ago where that truck's coming through, launching the, uh, pulling my kayak in. Here's the boat launch. It's a really nice boat launch. Um, we've launched our boat from here two or three times now. Uh, looks like they have some uh, parts of this that they're taking out for the winter. But we'll show you what it looks like generally. And this water, man, this water is really low right now. But this is generally what the launches look like. And there's usually another one over here too. So that's the one they got taken out. So there's four spots to launch and uh, load your boats over here. Come over here to the side, give you a better look. Now with this water being so low, and it's still cement all the way down here. I don't know how far it goes, but I'm betting it can't go much deeper than where we are. Yeah, there's a lot of sand down here, but people are still launching and loading, but they're doing it from a sandy bottom. It's not cement anymore. But yeah, it's a nice spot. Ah. Uh, so they got that right there. It says uh, low water cones mark end of ramps. So it says ramps may drop off. So if you're launching right here, and this is all sand right here, it might drop off uh, <laughs> before before the end of your trailer. So uh, just something to think about with these extra low levels right now. But otherwise, man, it's usually awesome over here. So, I can see the sign over here, it says Ebenezer Boat Ramp, so I'll put that in the title. That's it. That's it. Jordan Lake, Ebenezer Boat Launch, mid-November 2023. It's probably like low 70s out right now. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, perfect weather. Can't ask for anything better than this. A little windy, I could ask for some better wind, uh, less wind, but other than that, good times. Also wanted to show we do have a uh, bathroom at this launch, so it's mid-November, like I said, it's, I don't know if it stays open all year or not, but it's a good sign. It's at least open this far into the year, so bathroom, it's good, men's, women's, toilet the crap on, a couple of urinals and the guys, I don't know what's in women's because I don't roll that way. Peace. Set the road. Alright. It's a little windy today, so not the not the best day for kayaking, but not the worst either. It's uh mid-November, so A little chilly out in the morning. It's nice during the day though. We'll get down to like 35 in the morning, but it'll be 70 during the day, so it's a good day today. The water here is pretty low. It's the lowest I've seen it. We've only been here, you know, coming here a few years, but. I think I'm gonna go 
across the waterway over to that side. So I'll uh I'll pop the video back on when I get over there. I only got one battery today, so I don't want to waste too much. It can last that long. So over here we got the boat dock. Uh, I think it's Ebenezer or it's Poplar Point. I think it's Ebenezer, but I'll put it in the video uh, when I get home. But you can see the wind's kind of blowing a little bit, so uh, just uh, kind of drifting, fishing. Just trying not to be flipping up on this mission. I know y'all was wishing you was out here fishing with me because I'm an OG for real. That's what you want to see. R O T H to the E. Eating the Funyuns up in here on the kayak with me. All right, so it's enough of that.
Ne.